Hey guys, so today I decided to do a get ready with me because I was going to town today so I just decided to film myself getting ready and it's not like a full on morning routine, it's just like my makeup and my hair and my outfit kind of so yeah, without further ado, let's get on with the video Hey guys, so yeah, first I take my up and up moisturizer thing and I just put this all over my face because I have dry skin. This is like, this isn't my first video with um, voiceover because I had to do it in a class that I took. But this is my first video on my channel with voiceover, so I hope I do a good job. But yeah, I just rub this in. I really like this moisturizer because it's not, it's a cream, but it's not that oily like most creams. Like, most cream moisturizers are, like, really oily. So, I like sticking to ones that are more, like, gel. But, yeah. So, yeah, I just rub this in. Now I'm being dumb. Okay, so, now what am I doing? Oh, I'm taking the concealer. This is my NYX Incredible Waterproof Concealer. And I forgot to um, turn on my camera after I was done blending it. So, here's my bake. Yeah, I just use the Clinique um, loose powder to do this with. I don't know what I'm doing. Oh, now I'm doing my eyebrows. I'm going to do it off camera. Just a disclaimer, I'm not good at eyebrows. I have never been good at eyebrows. Um, so, yeah, do not hate on me. I hate on myself enough. And the lady, the cashier at Target, I'm pretty sure her name's Amy hates on me all the time with her eyes so yeah just thought I would add that so yeah now my eyebrows are done I don't know I'm being a weirdo but now I'm taking this really fluffy this brush is so soft it's elf and yeah I don't know the exact name of it because I'm too lazy to go into my bathroom and get it right now but I just use this to blend out my bake yep There's so much noise in the background. But yeah. This I love using this powder, the specific powder I use. It's by Clinique. It just makes your skin so soft. So yeah, there's that. Finished. So now I'm taking my NYX matte bronzer. This is in the shade medium. I love this bronzer. It's my OG. So yeah, then I just take this little tiny A Cosmetics brush. It's for powder, but I use it for bronzer because my bronzer brush isn't like gross. And I just put it where it naturally, like, is supposed to go. I don't, I don't know where else I would put it. And I always get it, like, all over my ear, but I, I'm too lazy to wipe it off. So, yeah. So, next I'm taking this trashy palette from Ulta. And I, I'm just taking this brush and putting blush on. I like the blush in this palette because it's really, like, peach-colored, and I'm already really red on my, like, cheeks, so I like peach-colored blushes a lot more than pink ones. Now I'm taking some tape to do my eye look with, and, yeah, I'm just too lazy to, like, actually learn how to do a winged eyeliner by myself, so I just use tape. And this is just, like, random tape I found in my house. And <laughs> I have eyeliner <laughs> swatch on my hand, so now I'm taking this MAC pink eyeshadow. I'm also too lazy to go look at the name of this. And then I have a little Eco Tools brush. I'm using that to blend it into my crease. So yeah, I love this eyeshadow. It's really pretty. Yeah, this is pretty boring. I should have edited this out, but I'm, again, too lazy. So yeah, I just blend this in, and then once I'm done with that, I grab my, it's another trashy Ulta palette, but it's for eyeshadow, and I'm taking this cinnamon color, and it's actually called cinnamon, I don't know why I remember that, but I do, and I'm putting this over the pink to kind of make it more of a, like an orange tone, like a rust color, I don't know why I don't just go to Ulta and buy like a rust colored eyeshadow. So I don't have to do all this blending together. 
but yeah. So now I'm saying, let's go somewhere. Oh, to the other eye. Now I'm using this MAC, um, like, eyeshadow stick thing. And this is in, like, pink sand or something. I don't know. Too lazy to get up and go look. So, yeah, I just put this on. It's like a light pink it's a glittery color. And blend this out. Because when I usually put glitters on, they don't really, like, stay. So the MAC, like, glitter stick things stay really good. So I just like using that a lot better than loose glitter pigment things. So then I did my eyeliner off camera because it took a long time. And so, yeah. Now I'm doing my mascara. And I'm using my eyelash curler first. This is from Smith's, which is a grocery store. Um, yeah. You don't know. I don't know if they're... They're probably, like, all over the country, but I live in Idaho, so... We have a lot of stuff here that, no, like, other states don't have. So now I'm taking my Clinique High Impact Mascara. This stuff is so good, to be honest. And I'm just putting this on my upper lashes. My eyelashes aren't that long, so... Any lengthening, like, thickening mascaras that I can buy, I will, like, automatically, like, bam put it in the cart so yeah now I'm taking my NYX the slim or like the skinny mascara this is so thin you guys and then I'm putting this on my bottom lashes because I don't know I feel like it takes too long to put on the top lashes even though it probably will make them like gorgeous so yeah and I don't know I just really like putting mascara on my bottom lashes I don't know why but I do so now I'm doing my lipstick and this is a Clinique one I'm pretty sure this is in the, the, in the color a different grape I really like this because it's like not too dark but it's like kind of dark still I don't know it's hard to explain you can tell I'm a pro youtuber by saying it's kind of dark but it's not that dark yeah, and then I take like five minutes fixing it with my fingers, and then I just end up rubbing my lips together and ruining all the parts that I fixed. So, yeah, I thought I was being cute. So, yep, there's the finished look, and I need to put setting spray on it, but I do that later. So, yeah. What am I doing? Oh, I forgot to put highlighter. So now I'm taking this little e.l.f. This is the large concealer brush, I think, but it's good for highlighter. And I'm taking the Ulta highlighter in the shade Yellow Diamond and just highlighting me up. Look at that glow. Ooh. So, yeah, I really like this highlighter. I feel like it looks really good on my skin tone. Because, like, a lot of highlighters I have, they're, they're like, whitish colored. Because I am bad at picking out eyeliners, apparently. But this one's really good, and the full size one's only like eleven dollars. So I've been meaning to buy it because I almost hit pan on this one, and I got it like right before Christmas time. But I'm just taking this beauty blender thing from Ulta, and I'm just blending it out to make it a little less harsh, because I don't want a straight line on my face of highlighter, obviously. So next, I'm putting my hair up into a bun. My hair is really like wavy naturally, so I can, I don't really like wearing it down. And I had to leave in like 10 minutes, so I wasn't bad at straighten it. So yeah, this is just how I do my buns. It, I could probably do it a lot better, but I didn't really care at this point. I just needed to get a video uploaded. So yeah, here's this, and so now I need to go pick out my clothes, and I have this, like, okay, I'll show you, this giant pile of clean clothes, because my best friend came over and she had to sleep, so now I'm doing some YouTube special effects, changed my shirt, and now I have pants on, but I'm not that flexible, so I couldn't really show you. Now here's my little jewelry tree thing, and I just pick out a headband that I want to wear, and like my jewelry, 
And so now more YouTube magic. I'm putting on earrings. Yay. So yeah, these are these it's earring. These earrings are really cute. They're like holographic in the middle kind of. So now I'm <laughs> What am I doing? Being stupid. Here's my favorite Uggs, by the way. And now I just have my purse and I'm all ready to go. I put setting spray on before this, so I wouldn't be all nasty looking. So yeah, that was my video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Please like, comment, and subscribe so I can try to grow my channel. Also, do you like the background? I try to make it really, like, bougie. Oh, there's my pig, but whatever. So, yeah, be on the lookout. I'm going to post another video on Wednesday, I think. And I'm trying to get a better schedule because I think waiting a whole entire week to post a video is quite a long time. So, yeah, I'm just trying to get everything figured out. But, yeah. So, yeah, again, I hope you liked it. Please like, comment, subscribe, and thanks for watching.